We are live. Let me refresh. Make sure we are set. Make sure you can hear us. Make sure you can see us. YouTube's a little late. And we are good. I was gonna post this link. It looks like we're looks like we're set. Let me see who's here. Before we no, we got a little little angle. Cool. Oh, there you go. All right. Uh William Perry, what's up? J and A. Uh the man misinformation. Uh, Ty Harris, RJ Funky Finds, Jimmy, Manny Fresh, Pablo, James, DK, DJ Grabs, Austin, Richard, still kicking sports, Austin, Josh Leva, True Win, Price Assassins, uh, Max, Stepper Fanatic, Jeff, uh, let's see, Jake, and Big Money Mo. Different Jake, by the way. Uh, District Deals, D-Bay, and Palma, Puma Hustler, Miles, Stephanie, Resell Freak, uh, Lucky and Three Legs, Dominic, Swoopman, Kevin, uh, The Plug, and more people coming in. Uh, Tyler is green. And um, let's see, Anna, Miles, Tyler is green says, be looking crispy tonight. <laughs> Camera, oh, look, camera does look good. Oh, well, camera looks good. Like you can see oh. how, how the, young this beauty, guy is. It's the beauty lighting right here. Yeah, exactly. You should be like a beauty influencer or something. Right, right. I should do that. Uh, let me see. Brandon, Johnny, and more people coming in. So B is in an unknown area. I mean, it's my green screen, new setup, you know. The <laughs> green Let's see, be out hustled solo, says the cat. Yeah, I mean, ever Faith. since COVID. <laughs> <laughs> Faith Lopez and more people coming in. All right, let me get this. Be as clear as hell. <laughs> Man, that's something to do with my camera today. Right. I'm using the same laptop. Dang. Is that, the, is that the same camera I use? Is that the same camera I use for OnlyFans? No, oh, see, now he froze because you're ever saying how great his camera was. Whoa, what happened there? Okay, you, fro <laughs> you froze. Okay, now you're back. Oh, uh, it's it's a uh, too high quality. It's yeah, high quality. <laughs> yeah, it's like struggling. YouTube struggling. That's like uh, 4K or something. Mm -hmm. All right, let me get this. Let's get started. Um, dunks. Anybody go and pick up more pairs? I my my own my stores only got two, so we only got. Well, actually, we only got two pairs because one of our store only got the black and blue one up here for men's. So me and the wife got that today. We didn't get any of these other ones, <laughs> but certain Foot Lockers and Champs did. And so who who got something out there in the chat? B, did you get anything out um, there? I did get the blue pair, the red pair, the All-Star. Okay. Uh, the All black the panda. Oh, panda. I we didn't get the orange and the gray mids. Oh, okay. And we did get the pink. We got the pink too. Oh, pink was even. I don't know if the pink's even there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Price Assassin says fifteen pairs. Man, <laughs> killing it out there. Uh, Hawaii Rams fan picking up the cobalt right now. There we go. Cool Kick says Cobalt thumbs down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like, isn't it the Cobalt, the blue one, right? Yeah, the blue one right here. Oh, <laughs> man. <laughs> uh, Josh Leva, my store's got no dunks. MC Incorporated, one men's size, one toddler, both the black one, so black and white. So, yeah, random little uh, drops here and there. Speaking of random drops, we also had uh, Kobe Grinch. Ooh. And yeah, my boy. Uh, shout out to Cisco. He texted us. I didn't win on anything. Point. On point. But he didn't win anything, but his wife did. Yes. <laughs> what size? Size, I believe, size five. She went with the smaller size. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Try to go for money size. You know, we were trying to uh, try to do the extreme sizing. Anybody in the chat uh, get lucky out there with sneakers app and got. A Kobe Grinch. I think Will. Shout out to my boy Will. He ended up got uh, he got a W in there too. Nice little Kobe Grinch. Josh Leva says L. Um, how do you find it when they drop? So um, it's a combination of 
<laughs> Foot Locker and all that going through the app with also checking like the sneaker news and things like that. Um, and just seeing when things are released. We go through the weekend releases every week. So, you know, that should yeah. give a nice little heads up too. Yeah. Um, and the sneaker app, uh, make sure you guys got the uh, notification on because usually it, you know, pings you or something like that. Um, we did get like the ping and, you know, some messages from, from people that got them. So, uh, always be in the loop, but it was, you know, like it was so like textbook though, you know, it was Kobe's what 50 years since he retired or something like that. Um, uh, but I would have expected the, the shoe that he wore. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, right. Like, so from, from what it looks like, they do have a lot of Grinch leftovers. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was the same day of him getting the injury and making the free throw. No, no, I think it was different? his last game. Oh, okay. I think it was a 60 point game. He's like, oh, okay. Yeah, his last game anniversary, something like that. Mm. But I could be wrong, or it could be, you, you probably could be right. But so that? I wonder how many, yeah, like you said, I wonder how many Grinches they have mm -hmm. <laughs> left over that yeah. they don't even talk about. All right, let's get into some of the updates out there. Uh, Star Wars Presto Mid Utility. It's not officially Star Wars, it's just like Star Wars colors. Mm -hmm. Does anybody care yes no really no. when i saw him i was like nah i mean well like i think the people that um are on the cold you know that gets winter stuff or gets cold um appreciate this <laughs> do you like the utilities like the well, Bristol utility yeah i did i did have one okay but, but apparently the olive one that i got went up in value so i had to sell it <laughs> <laughs> this um, guy's yeah, but uh, I mean, you know, we know, we all know, Presto is, is always comfortable. Um, yeah. But you know, it's kind of like, especially the acronym collab. I think that one's kind of mm. like a bunch of hype, so a hype with the Presto mids. But um, you know, besides that, I think it's just good for you know every day, keep you out in the cold, keep your ankles warm. <laughs> ankles warm. Let me see. It won't cop unless it Burlington and Marshalls though. Uh, John says, just killed it at Marshalls. Seven hours ago, seven pairs of elite cleats. Yeah, people killing it at Marshalls. We'll talk about that in the power rankings. Let's keep going. Travis Scott, Air Max One releasing holiday 2021. Apparently, this is like one of four or five different other colors that I think is supposed to come out. Yeah. I have no clue. This is like a little mock-up that they came out with. Man, I feel like best. Do you care in the chat? I feel like they're talking too much about Travis Scott, like all the drops that's coming, but but where's the drops? <laughs> I feel like we've been talking too much about his drops, rumors about stuff like that, but nothing so far. Uh, Rock the Kicks, what's up? Carolina, what's up? Mile High Hustle, what's up? Says those are fire. Um, yeah, what do you think about collection-wise, though? Too much Travis Scott? You want more Travis Scott? What do you want? I mean, for sure. I mean, with with what he's came out before, I mean, they're not trash. I mean, the qualities. And there's always something unique with the drops. Yeah. So I think that's something that's cool. Um, I think that's what makes collaboration kind of hype, right? But it's just if it's cool enough, um, and and it's unique enough, I think it's gonna do well. But what Nike does is, you know, how they always control the supply, so. Risa always goes up. So, you know, it, it's definitely, you know, I think every every sneakerhead would love one for the collection. But then the end of the day, it's like, you know, just pretty much what we did with our Travis Scott, man. It's like, oh, it's so dope. And then as soon as it starts sitting a grand, I'm like, oh, it ain't that dope. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It just, that's where things come into play. We're like, can I reuse this money into my business? Yeah, exactly. And use it for other things? Yeah. Or do you want to flex on IG for yeah. people? I don't know. <laughs> Exactly, exactly. But, uh, let's go to the next one. Oh, the other news about Nike refurbished their gives what worn sneakers a second life. And this will be at the outlets. A lot of people tagged me on the story. And not only that, every like sneaker YouTuber was like, Nike, they're selling used shoes. Yeah. It's like, oh man, gives us something for us to talk about. We don't have to just review the same Jordan ones over and over again. Right. And I was like, I thought Nike was already doing this at the outlets at like the bigger cities. Like I didn't think this was anything well, so new. Apparently, Glenn, from what I understood, 
uh, with what they did before. That was kind of like a pilot test. Mm, okay. You know, um, I knew there was one in Memphis, I believe, but for sure there was one in Portland. So I think mm. kind of like where their main warehouses are, stuff like that, because uh, I know uh, your return address goes to Memphis, you know, for people that has complaints, uh, tried on, didn't like them and stuff like that. And, you know, we all know Nike's pretty lenient with their return policy. So people just use them and return them once or twice, just flex for the gram. And if they, if, if it didn't go up in value for resale, they just return it, right? It's too much of that. <laughs> so, so I think, you know, I think it's good overall, but it has to be significantly cheaper because from what we've seen before, they just look like a back wall pricing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So they have to probably they have to come up with a better – pricing strategy since it's used or refurbished you got to be like 50 percent off right off the gate yeah but from what we've seen they're just like just back wall shoes yeah very true uh in the chat what do we think or how do you feel about the refurbished sneakers uh different comments in here so ku kicks nike has had a 60-day return policy for years now exactly i mean even when when uh you know, we had everything going on with pandemic. They, that was one of the first things we saw. Like they even put the signage up there, like 60 day returns. Like mm -hmm. if yeah. you don't like it and things like that, like they actually just put it out there. So it's like, all right, cool. You can return something like returns never stopped mm -hmm. because of that or anything. They kept it going. Uh, Big Money Mall used returns always been on hash. <laughs> well, every morning this guy's picking up all the returns. And yep. that's the thing is like, like B said, if they're not reselling good, they just go and return it. Mm -hmm. Like, ah, I wasn't as hyped. I can't really make any money on this. Here we go. And then Big Money Mo picks them up, gets extra 20% off or something. Right. And he's able to build upon that. So mm -hmm. the returns are there. Right, right. Uh, Coda121 watching, only 36 likes. Hit that like button. Appreciate that. Let's see. No more making basketball courts out of old used shoes. Uh, back wall shoes already look used. Everyone tries them on and they throw them back in there. But you hate when like you you're trying to you look at them and you're like, oh, okay, nice. And then it's missing like you know the shoe tree inside or yeah. like the bottom's all dirty. That's like yeah. that happens a lot too. Yeah, especially with that's why like I don't buy like white sneaker bottoms. Mm. You know, because they're just they just turn brown and then and then especially like the dimples, you know, or those like little hairy things. Oh yeah, yeah. You just get torn off and man i've i've been a victim of that with a goat and they always pick on that thing <laughs> it's the most noticeable thing let's see more opportunity for steals and deals is james uh ku kick says says uh they've always just thrown the worn stuff back on the shelves at the nike outlets and clearance stores yeah we've seen yeah. some stuff that's it's like what this isn't new what happened here so I don't know. I just didn't think it was a huge deal to make like a complete video about it because some people were asking like, "Oh, are you gonna talk about this?" Whatever. It's like I could talk about it on the live. I didn't think it was, yeah, anything huge. It's probably better for the environment and world more than anything, especially with the grind part and recycling that into other right, shoes right. more than anything right. else. Mm -hmm. um, other news: New Jersey. Anybody know where this is? So. Cape May, they're also getting a Ross, latest tenant of announced for Washington Commons. I was looking at the map and I was like, this is kind of like way out there. So I wonder if anybody is somewhat in this area, but uh, they are getting a Ross. So congrats. You can try another, another Ross. Well, Ross has been a little dry right now, so maybe not a congrats yet. So uh, Mile High Hustle says eBay app is fixed. Who Kick says fools dying for content, <laughs> extra thirsty. Uh, let's see, my summer vacation spot, bottom tip. There we go, Dapper Fanatic. Price assassins all fly in. Uh, let's see, 45 minutes away. There we go, A Will. Uh, Preston, Nita Ross, Northern New Jersey. Uh, Cape May is a bottom end of the world, <laughs> big money mole. <laughs> what? That's what I figured because I looked at the map and I was like, where is this? And I was like, that's kind of like way down there. But I mean, if you can hit on this in this Ross, good for you. But Try that out. We'll see when they open up. Um, how are your sales? People in the chat, good, bad, ugly. How's eBay, StockX, Go? Anything doing better than any other platforms or anything? How's that been, B? Um, it's still been good uh, compared to 
or last year's performance, but compared to the last month, month, mm -hmm. <laughs> it's kind of leveled off. So um, it's been good. Uh, I think one thing I realized how behind we were with a lot of stuff, and then now everything just kind of just jammed back into one. Oh, okay. So, so, but yeah, sales are still strong. You know, strong. Uh, hopefully, it'll stay here. Um, and I think, I think the uh, authentication delays has been, have been slowly catching up. So that's really yeah. They're slowly they're slowly coming around. I mean, the returns are still happening. I mean, not returns, but cases are still opening up. Right. It's like cases are opening up, but then some of the ones are kind of getting reviewed and they're done for. So now that money's coming in. Right. So they're they're still kind of like balanced. There's not really anything great yet, but hopefully by later on this month we'll see more of that money overturned and not on hold. Uh, let's go through the chat and see. Uh, Air Dalto sales are up. Goat the goat. April's on pace to beat March. Very nice. Look at three legs. eBay is booming. Johnny Puma Hustler. eBay has been decent. Slower this week. Faith Lopez. eBay killing it. RJ Funky finds. DJ grabs eBay strong. Abnett says bad. Tyler is green says bad. Everything just dropped except returns. Go is great. Jimmy eBay two thumbs up. Strong and steady. Mile high hustle. Big money mo sales popping as usual. I expect nothing less from big money mo. One uh, k in sales yesterday. There we go. DK slow for me. Preston sales are good on eBay and posh. DBay Anna golf Nike running stuff selling great on eBay. Hungry Hustle eBay for this month. For me, the most sales. Sales are okay from Austin. No fees on used. Still thrifting. And so a little mix, but most of the part, people looks like they're they're doing pretty good. All right, let's go to weekend releases. Did you see when they first posted about the KDs? Like the new KDs? Like I feel at this point. What was the best KD? Five, six? Oh man, I forgot. Um, five. So five was the trap. No, five was the high, like the high top looking one. Okay, okay. That was six. Good. Yeah, was six good. was the low cut, like really low cut. Okay. Uh, four. Yeah. You could have done four with the strap. Yeah, four is the strap. So four is nice. Twice, four was really good, right? Yeah. Uh, five was good. Five was kind of like the hyper dunk with an air bubble in the back. Yeah. Then six was kind of like sketchy. If you balled in the six, it looked like your ankle was just like it looked like, a, it looked like a soccer shoe. You yeah, know, like a soccer. Uh, but the latest one, I think it was was it eleven? The one that had flying it. That one was gonna be oh, full, yeah. full, full zoom bottom. Yeah, that one was good. Uh, I think the third uh, twelve was good. The one that had strap too. Mm. Uh, but. The last one, I'm not really a big fan of it. I think it went bulky. Because KD show has always been kind of like slim, yeah. you know? And then this one's kind of like taking on kind of like a Kyrie look. <laughs> Just because they play on the same team doesn't exactly. mean they have the same That's shoe. Let me see. KD5 was the best. Vintage Profit. Fourth, where it says Richard. Richard says it also has KD2. Man, that one is old. I remember that one. KD6 was my favorite. Sinker finds 12. KD's equal bricks. Who kicks? Four and six was my favorite. KD4 nerf. There we go. Astro Drip. I remember the nerf. All right, next. Reebok answer four. Iversons again. Maybe they'll hit Ross. People have been finding Iversons at Ross. Will they make their way? The answer four, definitely a classic. 130 comes out on Thursday. Um, Jake, man, we didn't play any like sound bites today. What happened? Yeah, man, I think at 130, I think this will sell. At 130? Yeah. I mean, you know. When they go down to 99? Uh, no, people are buying mids for 125. So they should be buying this too. Mm, maybe. You know, you know kind of like just a I cool shoe. Yeah. I think a cool summer shoe, especially the nostalgia that comes with it. And then, you know, hopefully Iverson does something, you know, relevant again. And then I think it will bring back memories. Very true. Not, uh, see, not feeling it. Mile High Hustle, Pass, Josh. Still salty about not getting the pumps. A will. A lot of people are fans of these Ku Kicks. Uh, those are wax, says Jorge Bravo. All right, next. Sean Witherspoon, the Super Earth. 
Man. Uh, 140 comes out this Friday for Earth Day, I believe. So yeah. April 16th. Um it should have been like Adidas ZX 2020. <laughs> it's, uh, you know, a patch of everything. Here's the thing, like, I like what Witherspoon's about. Of course, everyone loves the Nike that he had, everything going on with the 97 one, everything mm. like that. But <sighs> number one, I can't do it with these strings things here on the side. It's like... You it's can't, like, you won't. Man, it's like if my grandma was a shoe cobbler and she thinks that I'm a sneakerhead... And she makes something really special, and this is what will come out. Yeah, you know, it's like, oh, you would feel so bad. It's like, oh, Grandma, you could have done it with ones, but Grandma didn't have access to ones, only to ZX8000. <laughs> you know, but put this, put this on a 97, you know, uh, put this on something iconic, uh, or at least like Ultra Boost, man. Come on. Come on, Adidas. Come <laughs> on, man. Now, here's the thing, though. Ku kicks very, very correct. I mean, his ASICs were dope, though. They were very clean, different colors. Of course, we love the Nike stuff, but once it got to Adidas, I was just like, wasn't feeling a lot of this thread stuff, and I don't know. It's just, but will they sell out? I think you had to go through the app from the very beginning, no? Or something with Adidas first in order to get up. Yeah, confirm app. Something yeah. Like yeah. All right. Dunk Low Women's Green Glow, $100. If you can get them or not, it comes out Friday as well. And exclusively in women's sizing. So if you can get your size in men's, would you rock these in the chat? Oh, this is clean. Dude, the 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 pink and the, the what was the Coastal that came out today? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, those are See, like, this is what I want with the dunks. I want the dunks to be something different from what the Jordan 1 low uh, color blocking would be or the, just the, you know, the, uh, the color scheme. I want them mm -hmm. to be fun. And I think that's the reason why uh, this one I, – I, I just hope they don't, want, they don't make this so limited, though. That's what they've been doing with the cool color dunks. Yeah. And they give you the GR Cobalt Blue. You know, it's like, <laughs> man, it's just kind of like Royals one, you know, something like that. But I'm still, like, just shocked on the whole dunk factor. Like, just how every, I don't know, like, wannabe influencer is just rocking dunks. And then everybody just wants dunks. And it's like it's... It's wild because nobody was wearing dunks. Uh, you know who's salty? Time. You know who's salty, Glenn? The skateboarders. I feel for them. Yeah. They're like, uh, like I know a few people that just hardcore dunks, right? And then now they're like having to like, now it feels like a Jordan release for them. Yeah. And, you know, like, because skate shops get this, but, you know, even the SB ones are the harder to find. This is just the regular dunks. <laughs> yeah. Right? Uh, so now like what the limited SBs, you know, the difficulty of getting them has now transferred to just the regular dunks. Yeah. But but I do give it to this uh silhouette though. Like I think they're clean for just daily. I mean, like I, I would so much prefer seeing people wearing this than just Air Force ones. <laughs> the I'm, all white TikTok Air Force. Yeah, one. like uh, one guy said, "This are Air Force duns. Come on, <laughs> like just let's just get it over it, you know. Like plus the people that are trying to wear the rock, the all black one, and stuff like that, the all red. Like, you know, <laughs> I would love to see TikTokers wear more dunks if they could afford it or if they could have access to it. I would like them just to wear anything different besides Jordan One Dunk and Air Force One. Wear anything else? Shock oh. me." Yeah, okay. I don't know. Well, they wear Skechers too, so. <laughs> Outlet Dunks 2017 were 39 bucks for sure. Nobody was buying them at 69 bucks. That's it. I think it was uh, Big Money Mall. Yeah, mm -hmm. in 2019. Yeah, I've, uh, the, uh, what was that? The black and blue mids or high? Man, they were like giving them away. <laughs> yeah, I, know. I, I, I remember buying them. I remember buying them for just the, 
red Nike Air Box. Mm. And I would just replace it, you know, put an Air Box 97 <laughs> there and just sell the dunks. And <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's get into the next one. Neighborhood undefeated Adidas. ZX8000. And this one, too. I don't know what's with Adidas putting out ZX1000 to everybody. Hey, do a collab on the shoe. <laughs> Let's go to the next. Yeah, undefeated gets 97s. And I know. <laughs> and Kobe's. Yeah. Right, let's talk about the shoe. Okay, so B, what do you know about it? What can you share about it? Men's, because... are, men's are delayed for sure. It's going to be mm-hmm. raffled, right? Because we, mm-hmm. we don't see it in the app grade school right don't get too hopeful because app will show you you have like three to four or five stores in your area but man a lot of them don't have it in stock they're supposed to get it this week but i just you know got off to talking to a few full lo- a full locker house house of hoops which are supposed to be bigger and you know should have more access to this limited shoe they said Man, I mean, even the managers are sad. <laughs> I know. So that's the thing, too. So, yes, you're, you're correct. Men's is not on the app. Mm-hmm. Sneakers drop will be entering in for raffle. It's not going to be like it's a draw. It's, right. it's a draw. So it's like that's even going to be tough. Men's are delayed. I don't know how they're going to work that out with the re-raffles. Maybe it's going to be like UNC's to where it's like three different drops weeks in a row. I don't know. Kids, we're not even getting in our area. I saw it there in the app. I tried it, nothing. But even then, like you said, some of them that are supposed to get them are not getting them. I mean, foot 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 action is not even getting them. Like you know, they didn't even put them out there. Yeah, they're not even on the app. Yeah, for them. yeah. and then you know, from the few people that I talked to, it's like they didn't even get an invoice for them. Mm. So one is, you know, looking to be so limited now, and then. A foot action moved moved on. They actually put the Jordan Eleven lows ready. Yeah, I saw run. That. <laughs> so I guess you know, man. April is so wild. Like, like April has made us travel so much, which I'm not complaining. It's cool, but I I don't remember like a month being jam packed like this. Yeah. Imagine if this actually dropped. <laughs> I, I, I think I'm kind of like relieved that that it, this one's not dropping really, because we know with what happened with UNC, right? For example, they got 50 percent of the inventory. They still ran a release, and we still had two more re-releases. Mm-hmm. So I could just see that in this one, I think we're gonna have four re-releases on this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So keep checking, double checking the app, go into the store, don't call. Go to the store, figure out who you have to talk to. Trust me, some employees they're tired of getting the same oh, questions. Sure. They hang up. I'm I'm there. They <laughs> like don't answer that. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Did anybody hit on exclusive access though, Radio? Yeah. So I don't know, we saw that as well. Yeah. Let me see. Foot Locker managers said they weren't getting theirs on time. Said the app would show reservation open next week. It didn't even get their full order of Raging Bulls Mile High Hustle. That that. That's also true too. I mm-hmm. know uh, one of uh, one of the stores just got the kids raging bulls in, and yeah, finished. So. I was like randomly putting them out today, uh, and then one for locker actually. Uh, if you want to dunk, you get a great school Toros. <laughs> <laughs> These guys, uh, I'm like okay, okay. Uh, I know Hibbit and City Gear isn't getting them. Mm-hmm. Uh, at least for this release. Uh, Ku Kick said that other stores get theirs. What about Shoe Palace? They still have raffles. Yeah, I think they're just dead raffles. <laughs> Last time I went to Shoe Palace, they still did the old school way where like, you're putting like yeah. your name into a hat. <laughs> dude, dude, some, some, some JD Sports do that. <laughs> Man, he gave me flashback to five years. Talk about, talk about like uh, doing the... Uh, doing the what do you call that the the costume thing because i would go in in the morning and i would fill up raffle and then come back change clothes and everything like that and put in more raffle <laughs> yeah. oh man i mean that's just i don't know only thing i can say is you got to put in work to get this shoe oh for sure um and who knows you might just 
you know, catch it on an off day that they yeah. ended up getting them in that you didn't even know about. So, Glenn, Glenn, you had to put in work to get the Raging Bulls, the Carmines. Imagine yeah. what you have to put in work for this. For this, yeah. <laughs> you have to pull strengths. Yeah, I mean, like, one guy said, like, there's going to be a lot of friendship that's going to be, you know, ending because of the shoe. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this thing is just insanely hyped. All right, power rankings last week. It's about that time. 200 people plus watching. Man. You got to hit that like button. We got to keep going with this live show. Power rankings? Come on now. Marshalls on top. Number one, Burlington. Two, this was last week. And Ross at three. Here we go. Ross still number three. I am pretty disappointed on what they're well, they haven't really got anything good at all. I mean, I've seen a lot of Under Armour. I've seen a lot of dad shoes, a lot of RBX as usual. Um, nothing really that's like, I mean, this guy did find Off-White. Congrats to him. Right, right. Um, K. Vasquez, I think, is what this sounds for. Anyway, congrats to him. But there's a whole lot of just like little things here and there. Nothing really like amazing compared to some of the other stores. Um, so Connor, yes, that is uh, off white there. Uh, let me see. So we got let's see Brian, and we got Jersey Surge with the KD uh, basketball tights, ten bucks. Flipping for funds, I did find the Disney bag. I believe sold for like one thirty. So one of the sleeper finds out there. Flipping for funds. Congrats on that one. Um, flash alert, news alert. I mean. Check breaking your, news from the B. Breaking news. Check your Nike sneakers app because you could have access to the Nike Dunk High Hawaii's or mm. the Jordan 11 Legend Blue. So apparently Nike is trying to cover up uh, and you know put on some smoke to cover the mess up for this Jordan <laughs> Hyper Oil. So check check your apps real quick because it's it's real. So if you get them, uh, I think uh, I think tomorrow will be the time to purchase it. But if you don't have it in your app, check it on a desktop version. But mm, I have to try it. Hopefully, at least somebody in here get it. <laughs> I gotta check one of the. I may just keep trying different accounts. <laughs> one of them has to. Have That's it. why you don't. Oh no, be froze. Let's see if it comes back. Uh, let's see. Anybody? Che they're checking the app. So and yeah. B. He'll be back. Okay, there he is. He's good. All right. Let's go to the next. Uh, Maximum 2300 sold out. And Wow Nice Shoes won. And Lee Kirk Goods. We got some of the hockey jerseys, the PSG. Hockey, like we said. We got the React Golf. And some of the Adidas cleats. At the I did see some of these out there in the wild. Next. There you go. Radio said hit on the Jordan 11 low. Oh, <laughs> Man, I feel like I won too now. I think this is what we got to do, Glenn. Let's just all collaborate and, you know, at least the L's won't hurt too much. <laughs> we can all take L's and then a couple of W's here and there. Yeah. Uh, Glenn, can you tell your workers at Ross to get more heat, please? I've been trying. Nothing. I mean, clothing stuff, which is what's here. Maximum 2300 again. Brian, some of the jerseys out there. Martino finds a hey, money. So he's definitely making some some good bucks there, flipping for funds, and some of the hockey jerseys, soccer jerseys, and more. Next, one kick finder vapor grip three down to what ten bucks? High retail on it. I forgot what it was like 130, 140. Uh, Oregon flip finds Ross Guru. Also got the cleats out there, twenty seven dollars, and some of the Project Rock for women's C and J Enterprises. Next, uh, try sticker deals, justified creations boutique, Brian again, and flip the script. So, some of the golf out there, and it's a little mix between Ross and I think Burlington and Marshall's, all of them, a little mix of different golf shoes out there. So, take a look at that. A tribe called Steel's Iversons, and they're uh, what Eric Emmanuel priced at like 180 range, $40. And a size, what, nine and a half there. So congrats on that one. Tribe called Steels. Don Alpha Cleat dominating as usual. 
we got the VaporMax Flyknit Oreo. And we also got some of the Air Max 90 Infrared Sandal out there. Don Afaklete, always finding random stuff that we won't ever find. But congrats to him. We want to see him win. And we just hope that one day some of this stuff just trickles down to our stores. Uh, flip the script with the LeBrons for a kid size 4 and 40 bucks. Uh, we got more Ross Fines. We talked about the Iverson. So Reebok Answer 5 Iverson, $33. Good money to be made on them. Um, let's see, Richard, Ross Guru, Lee Kurt Goods, and Ross Guru again. So we got the Georgetown and what, 40 bucks, I believe. So um, at least you can find those out there. I've been trying, have not seen them. Maybe they'll show up. See, Don Affleck equals the GOAT, still kicking sports. Uh, too legit, what's up? We see so many golf shoes. RJ Funky finds. My Ross is on fire, SoCal. Next. Little mini cart fools. So, Mile High Hustle, Cole Hans, good money to be made. It's probably one of the best, uh, I think, Ross tags we've had for the last week. Bam, 24 kicks. At least the tempos are still out there. High end cleats. JT resells. Furious flipper. Air Max 1 on the golf. So like uh, RNG said, lots of golf out there. Keep going. There we go. Cartful, Stevie D, Furious Flipper, Puma Hustler, Don Alpha Cleat again, Air Max 95, two different pairs, Vapor Max, and 97s. So Don Alpha Cleat doing his job. All right, Burlington time, four stars. Ross, I said they're at three stars. They're still at number three. Kind of disappointed. Um, let's see what happens. We're taking it week by week. We're hoping they'll get better stuff. So let me see. Uh, cool kicks. I just remembered, Glenn. Did you sell them purses from that big haul? Yes, I did. I'm glad I don't have to see those anymore. <laughs> Next to like sneaker inventory. So yes, they're they're out and they're gone. All right, Burlington flipping kicks. Interesting. So, <laughs> so this shoe was on the rack at Burlington. Mm -hmm. No price tag. Super dirty. One of the insoles had no, it was just like a black insole. The other insole had an Adidas logo. So, what do you take of that? I mean, somebody took it for a joyride. <laughs> <laughs> someone they wore them they left them on the shelf a little switcheroo and maybe they took the insoles yeah like, oh, i really that, love these insoles. i think that was supposed to go to nike refurbished program <laughs> <laughs> so i think you said that uh flipping kick said he asked the manager well this isn't really active inventory so can i just take them and then he just took them so <laughs> free shoes though yeah i mean clean them up sell them <laughs> yeah the nice little switcheroo switch them out rbx switcheroo fake vapor max grabbing those Clavin klein dress shoes instead uh let me see six dollars cash out the door uh switcheroo so they got some new mario lopez <laughs> db all right let's go burlington finds Wow, nice shoes with the Chicago jerseys. And we got flipped the script out here. PSG pants, $275 retail, $30. Jordan jersey flipped the script again. And uh, 100 retail, 20 bucks. Real deal thrifter. And some of the Jordan jackets and that Puma jacket. I, I think Richard picked this up too. I don't know who else, but also pick, picking these up. I wonder if they did sell already, though. Let me know in the chat. Next, Sin City Hustle with the Jordans. Four pairs. Um, See, so also got Amrak Zypher out here. So $70. A Dapper Fanatic with the LeBron 16 TD Little Big Cat. Two pairs. And then Richard dominating as usual. We got the Air Max 1 Golf, and we got some of the cleats out there. Burlington hitting up for me, says Preston. Let's see. B hasn't looked up since his breaking news. Checking his 10 sneakers accounts. Dapper fanatic. 
<laughs> I'm just out here trying to scour some information so I could share it to you guys. Yeah, see, B is coming at you with fresh info. Uh, what's going on with that blazer? Richard says five watches right now on the Puma jacket. Picked up two Puma jackets yesterday, 10 bucks, says Jeff. So try that out. I don't know how much they're selling for. I know they were super high retail, but I don't know what they were selling for. Indy finds Ron 23 sells uh, my boy miles out here picking up the 97. So good to see some stuff showing up at Burlington again, pretty dope cleats as well. Let's keep going. We got hungry hustle furious flipper 97s hunt collections with the air max 90 and their $20 coming in a nice little box. What was the retail on these 45 bucks? Super tiny though. With the shoes, Hungry Hustle with the up tempos out there for kids. Camo up tempo. All right, next one. Puma Hustler with the cleats. Wow, nice shoes. Hungry Hustle again. Um, Air Max Plus, 40 bucks. I believe there are kids though. Yeah, size four in kids. And we also got Hungry Hustle again in loose cannon finds. With uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, man, nine, a little mix of golf and soccer. So nice little pickup there. Loose cannon finds. All right, next. Lazaro, have a Nike day on the 97s. Good money. More 97s in Air Max Plus. So nice little pickups right there. KS reselling with the cleats. Uh, Joey with some of the cleats as well, and uh, Funky Finds. We got the 95s and Air Max Plus, Hardens, and more. Man, a lot of variety in here. Yeah, it's good to see Burlington getting random stuff because it was a little dry for, for a bit. Yeah, it's either that or just Golf Air Max One. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Baker Brand Hustleby is the reseller, Adam Schefter. <laughs> That's funny. Breaking news. All right. Upstate oh. kickers. Man. CJ so, grabs. Freak. The last two days, I've went to more Burlington's than I've went in the last month in combined. <laughs> because, looking of, for these? because of those kind of fines. I know. This is uh, a DJ grabs two pairs. Upstate with a pair and resell freak as well to Ket also with the fives. Not the same as the golf, but all of these winning W's all around. Connor, good lord, more fives. That's crazy. Great finds, AK Rowdy. Uh, let's see, go to the next. We haven't even gotten into Willie Will or anything like that yet. District mm -hmm. Deals. A nice little mix. We got the Jordans, and we also got Air Max Plus, Romaleo, Sneaker Finds 12, Cleats on Cleats on Cleats, Ron 23 Sells, Handful of Cleats, and Resell Freak. That's kind of weird, too. So Burlington been showing up with Air Max 1 Golf. <laughs> That's kind of random. I don't think I've seen these. I mean, a bunch of them at Ross, but Burlington. Uh, but this is money. This one was also at Ross, so. Hmm. They should have returned it. They're sharing, They're sharing inventory. Yeah. Uh, Island Green Fives are crazy dope coup kicks. Uh, I think that was the only one out of everybody that tagged us this week from Tiket that found them. Um, let me see. We got Ron 23 Cells. There, at least the Jordan 5 golf is still out there. Uh, McLovin with the jerseys, Chicago. Lazarode again <laughs> found. Was Lazarode also founded at Ross and <laughs> Burlington? What's going on? You're sharing inventory? <laughs> I just I just can't find them. there's I feel like I'm missing them like just you know how you just scroll past through them and yeah. then the moment you try to stop it's just like a random like just a basic you know white dry fit uh, brand X and then just get <laughs> mad and then you think like oh man I miss it you never know yep I gotta check um Ari's also let's see we got Vapor Max and Air Max Plus so picked up three pairs all right next Cartful and Handful R&J Funky Finds great week uh Vapor Max Plus 98 cleats also the Jordan Golf man and then more cleats handful of cleats 
crazy stuff out there. MC Incorporated Vapor Max 97s Man. and Finds and Flips Vapor Max Plus and uh, Man, those pairs. Vapor Max Plus. Those Vapor Max Plus, I've sold them for 200 plus. Yeah, these are the rare because they're like rare. Like I think this the the orange one is not even on stock X. Yeah, I think it's on goat only. Yeah. yeah. Um, let's see, this is not my Burlington Mile High Hustle. Uh Hustle Westbrook NBA tanks all day. <laughs> That's all I've been seeing at Ross. Uh let me see. Kenyon runs again. <laughs> that one, yep. Yeah. Um I'm willing to sell them for a hundred chip. <laughs> <laughs> So Sneaker Steel Finder District Deals. That's man, the 97 camo is back. Um man, how old are these? Oh <laughs> the vibes. Yeah, that's crazy. More of the Vibramax Plus, uh Sneaker Steel Finder. Oh, Sneaker Steel Finder. If you have a size 11 in this, let me know. Why do you 70 react? <laughs> 270 like, react. What? You're like this guy's going backwards. That's hype beast. That's no, this no. What's the name of that? Oh, of all, dude, I have so many reacts. React to seventy, you can have one. <laughs> no, <laughs> I do have one. I have the uh, the black and he wants that one. He wants what? Yeah, what's, the story? what's the story behind that though? Bauhaus one. It was like the first. I think it was the first colorway that first came out from that yeah. two seventy react. Exactly. Lazarus flying it. If you're oh, flying it, two twenty right there. I don't know. Right in the cart. Lazarus yeah. been killing it out there and flipping it good. Has been doing well. Been he's always been consistent, but even yeah. more finds yeah, cleats yeah. and golf and more right, golf. Next, this is where we get wow. into random, wow. random one-offs, loose cannon finds. I think these, uh, I don't know what the lowest listing was, like 1100 or something. Dude, I would frame that until somebody buys it off of me for 1500 or trade you a Travis Scott. <laughs> Travis Scott trade. <laughs> so we got this, we got done off of Klee, Swarovski 97. I mean, just flexing it. It doesn't Man. even need to flex at this point. It's just. That Swarovski though. I don't so know. It, it is what it is. That's that's a women's shoe, right? Yeah, this one is. Yeah. Uh stealthy finds out here. Nice. That one's money too. Yeah. I haven't seen these in a long time. Plus and, uh, that tie-dye on that React golf. Yeah. I know. Richard actually sent me a message because we were trying to figure out. Because he was like, I don't know if it's a sample or not. I thought it was might have been a sample we we're looking at it, but I think he ended up finding it. It's not uh, 99 but, UPC. Is no. It? But that's I mean, good money too. So I mean, yeah, I would just put PE. <laughs> <laughs> it has to somebody. It has to be somebody's PE. Man, so there we go. Let's go to Marshalls. Is still number one. What? And uh, flip the script. Found uh, the bikes. Remember we talked about the bikes last week? Yeah, the bikes. Yeah, four hundred bucks. <laughs> They're waiting for these <laughs> to go down to one yellow tag. Two. Yeah, one ninety nine. Hey, yeah, we need this for yellow tag. Uh, extra grand's 10 bucks. It's my birthday tomorrow. Had a great week of sourcing. I'm off to Mexico on Saturday. So congrats to you. Happy birthday. How how old are we turning? How young are we out there? Uh, extra grand's. Congrats. Happy birthday. Enjoy that nice little vacation and a good week sourcing. I like that. Uh, my high hustle getting my first vaccine this Friday. Other option was to have hustle be sneeze on me. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually wanting to get tested for the uh, antibodies, antibodies mm. or something like that. Um, but we'll see. I'm afraid of needles, so. <laughs> Righto asked, did you see Post Malone Crocs cart full at Goodwill? Oh. But for 500 sold crazy amounts. I did see that. That was wild. Was I think it, it was in Oregon. Oregon? Oh, no, no, it was Memphis. Oh man! Oh Memphis! Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was in Memphis. Yeah, why? Why does crazy like Goodwill Hawks has to be right by Nike or something? <laughs> yeah, that one was crazy. Try to find that post if you guys want to look at that one. But yeah, it's the so many of them. Too. Yeah. Uh, all right, Marshalls. Let's continue. Flip the script with the polo jackets, and I think down on red tag and retail on it uh, five ninety eight. Ross Guru 
also with the golf. I guess they're all showing up different colors with box. Vapor Elite batting gloves, loose cannon finds. Keep going. More batting gloves, Oregon flip finds with the trout batting gloves. Loose cannon finds out here with the camel backpacks. My high hustle, man. Look at that with Jordan. Ooh. Yeah, man. Ooh, I remember I, I, I found one. It took forever to sell, but I, I sold for like $4.99, something like that, because you have to find that exact person. Mm. Um, but this one, though. And I still get messages from the people that bought the, uh, the chest shield if I found uh, the knee protector to, mm, match. to match. Yeah. So, so the matching fit. Yeah, they wanna they wanna look cool and it's like, oh I'll play for a traveling whatever or whatever. It's like ah, you're not even the real deal. <laughs> this guy just ends up making fun of all <laughs> Wait, wait, I thought you were a pro. It's like, oh you're just a touring guy. <laughs> uh, let's see, mile high. Any story behind this? Anything I want I'm interested to know I don't even know what the price was or anything, but let's see what he says in the chat. They're not cheap. I think I paid ninety nine something for mine. Mm. Or one forty nine. Well, there you go. Mile high says fourteen watchers already. Nice. Air Max Pusher. More of the gloves out there. Thirty bucks. And let's keep going. DJ grabs. I think this is where we get to the point to where people are just fully dominating with like boxes and boxes of stuff. <laughs> Like cleats and golf, and it's just a wild mix. DJ Grabs, Phantom Vision Elite, Jay Minaj, which has been flexing on us with cleats and boxes and everything. Congrats to her. Mile High Hustle and complete with box, unlike at Ross. We just find them out there in the wild just as is. But gone with box, that's good. Jay Minaj again, and $30, and man, those gold boxes are out there. Next, uh, N8 Sneaker Finds, we got the Jordan cleats. I think they were $20. Yeah, that was wild. He found a bunch of them, too. Yeah, a bunch of these out there. Finds and Flips, Furious Flipper, and Dapper Fanatic, all with silver boxes. Oh, Dapper with the gold boxes. Just, just like money everywhere. Everyone just picking them up like nothing. Right, right. Everybody pulling a big money mall. Yeah, everybody a willy will. Plus, like what I like about Marshalls is like, you know, like they're just cool about it. You just buy how many you want. Yeah. Oh, you want the box on the back? Here you go. Oh, you want to yeah. go to the back? Yeah, we have more. We're like, you want more? I was like, yeah. yeah. Oh, and our bathrooms are open. <laughs> oh, Marshalls. Yeah. And cleaner too. For the most part. For most. Let's check with those bathroom reviews. Yeah. <laughs> Black. And Lazy. <laughs> Lazy. Uh, Ron23 sells gold boxes stacked up. It's our official cartful. Jai Love and Chico. We got uh, 20 bucks on them. How many did he get? Three of them of the Vapors. So nice. Uh, let me see. Next, Sun City Hustle and Maximum 2300 with the glove. Outer Hyperfuse baseball glove. Hundred dollars selling for three fifty. All you gotta do is find that right buyer. That's all you mm -hmm. need. Yo, uh, price assassins with a smart cycle. <laughs> <laughs> Man, they're still out there. They're still out there. So always double and triple check. Yeah, you never know. Still out there, maybe just in my closest marshals that I'm not going to. <laughs> uh, let me see. Next on JT resells. Man, how many of the gold boxes? Uh, looks like 12 of those plus more cleats out there. Man, do you think the ones that are in the orange box don't have the extra bag? That they do or they don't? They what don't. They? They, oh, don't. they don't. Okay. Yeah, I think they don't have the extra bags. Or maybe they're just the anti-clog ones or the uh, SG ones. Because mm. okay. those are replacement box because they usually come in a silver box. Mm, okay. Uh, let's see, we got more. Man. Uh, Sneaker God finds and flips. Broadway B and uh, Puma Hustler. So Brent, our boy Brent out here. Man, and, and whoever designed Marshall's carts needs to be fired. <laughs> like, These mini carts, little ass carts. Well, if they're going to design it, like at least kind of like design it that you can fit like five. Like, 
you can fit awkwardly four, you know, and just like the shape of them is just like so off. So maybe we can submit a proposal of a better looking cart or more ergonomically friendly for resellers like us. You know what I like about Target is like they got big carts that are like big plastic carts. Like and those big, actually fit quite a bit of stuff. Yeah, yeah. And then you go to Walmart and then they're all like janky. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. A broken wheel and it's rough out there. <laughs> all right. Uh, next, Furious Flipper. Uh, Joshy Sneaks. Premium Closet. Puma Hustler again. So, man, everybody's finding them out there. Not happening, B. I always ask, like, when I walk in, they're like, oh, you need a cart, sir? Nah, I know you guys just have trash. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, next time, I'm just going to bring my hand cart. <laughs> yeah. I, around. <laughs> I'm just here at Marshall's to go pee and leave. Go to Ross. Even Ross hasn't even hey, been helping Hey, you have those uh, grimy old brown plastic carts though true mm -hmm. very true oh tj max has more of them right yeah yeah uh let's go to the next one round 23 sales oh two cards <laughs> <laughs> we got two cards up in here sticker and, still binder man and they, and they never have like the right size bags and they don't know how to bag <laughs> did you guys notice that look at look at how they bag that one so random how would you put like two in one on top of each other? <laughs> like really, Man. you could pin four right there. B is not having it with Marshalls no, at all. They're just they're just hurting the environment, man. You know what, Marshalls? If you want to be number one, yeah, some things got to fix here. And there. Get it together. <laughs> Let's see. While I hustle, I went to pee in the women's <laughs> bathroom today. I didn't notice the midstream and saw women <laughs> walking. Oh, really? My <laughs> oh. oh, man. <laughs> he got me at the midstream. <laughs> All right, let's go to... Uh... <laughs> exactly, Mr. Eric. I'm spoiled with the outlet bagging. They know how to bag. They even ask you, you want four in there or it's only three? Mm. Only three. <laughs> let's not push it today. Yeah, I don't got no long fingers that I could just grab it across across the thing <laughs> it's a7 resells puma hustler again man joey and brown town finds at this point we're just we're just full cartfuls everything um it's like again lucky and three legs super six four dj grabs furious flipper this is like everybody's location it's just randomly marshall's getting them gold boxes Oh, that was it. We were done for that. So power rankings this week actually downgraded Ross. They shouldn't be three. There should be two and a half. Ross, two and a half. Burlington at four. Marshalls at four and a half. Slightly over Burlington. Uh, only reason also is because, well, not every Marshalls has been hitting. But not only that, it's very similar to all the other finds. Like, you're finding a bunch, but everyone's finding the same shoe. So I'll now kind of break it down to the sizes. What are people finding? All right. Giveaway time. I know I have my answer this time. I'm well prepared. You got two I've minutes. I've done live shows before. You got two right? minutes. You got two minutes. Baker Brand, 200 plus watching. Only 78? Man. 78 likes? Should Sad. we even do a giveaway? Sad. B. Dude, oh, I would just man. give the giveaway to me. Give it to me. <laughs> Come on. Okay, let's hit that like button. Here we go. How many listed are on eBay brand new? I need the exact number. How many listed on eBay? B, take a guess. Oh, I would say 25. <laughs> Someone already got it. Oh, really? Yeah. Really? Let me go through it. Somebody got it. I know I saw the answer. They were quick on it, too. Correct answer is eight. Victor, you have won. Eight. Wow. You're right after mile high, right before AN, they said six. I, want, so, I, wonder, I wonder how much they're selling for. Um, They were listed at $5.99, I believe, when I checked. 
Man, some are at four ninety nine, some are at five ninety nine, but not many solds on it. Mm. So we gotta wait until this goes yellow tag. Right. What was the most you said you were gonna pay? One forty nine. Yeah, one forty nine. <laughs> oh, Victor, two weeks in a row now. So there we go. Now I can pay double. Oh. All right, we are done. Um, anything else going on? B's gonna keep us posted and flex on us if he gets hyper royal. So we'll be looking for that. That looks like a young hustler hacks on the box as well. <laughs> Dude, that is. That is. Man, can we Dude's zoom in? To go for like a prom or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. He's going to prom wearing prom with the vibes. <laughs> Man. Uh, nice. <laughs> Nice catch, though. Nice catch. Yeah, that's a nice catch. Miles. Yo. Yeah. Definitely got the eyebrows and the huge hey, head. Dude, the name, though. Swag. Swagtron. <laughs> I see you. I see you. Velvet Blazer. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Over under how many hustle, how many pairs I'll get. Oof. That's going to be the hardest bet. Oh, over and under? All yeah. right, let's see. We'll hopefully be conflex on us, and we'll see how many he picks up. All right, we are done. I'll see you guys on Friday's video. Uh, working on it. Should be a Ross video, and then we'll see what we do for Monday. All right, we'll see you guys. Go out and get